what would you say a life group is? You know, if we, if we were to look, if we were to look in, into Scripture, I believe that the greatest example we see is within the book of Acts. As the early church is beginning to be developed and established on the solid foundation, which is Jesus Christ, we see that, that believers were coming together and they were gathering around the table, breaking bread. They were having fellowship and studying God's word. And, and they were doing this not only in people's houses, but they were doing this in the synagogue. It is a beautiful representation of what it looks like to live life together as believers. If, if I were to give a simple definition of what a life group does, what it is, a life group is a place where we foster our relationship with God and with one another. At Mount Olive Baptist Church here, come the turn of the year, we are seeking to establish life groups uh, here. That way we can have places for you as congregation members to, to gather together outside of a Sunday morning or, uh, or uh, outside of necessarily a Wednesday. Maybe you gather at somebody's house to study God's word, to just eat around the table, have a cup of coffee, some fellowship, some prayer time, just to invest in one another as one believer to another. You know, what, why is this important though? This is important for, for many reasons. We, we see in life groups three main purposes. One, it is to foster relationships with, with one another, to grow our relationship with one another. It's also important because we grow our relationship with God. When we are encouraged and, and pushed uh, by our fellow brothers and sisters in Christ, we are gonna grow in our relationship with Christ. But number three, and I believe something that's very important, something that's often overlooked, is that discipleship and mentorship and life groups help develop the future leaders of our church. You know, all three of these things are extremely important, but the, the list goes on. It, 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 is, it is the application of, of God's word in our life and coming together. It is, it is being uh, kept accountable for godly living in our life. It is caring for one another. It is used for evangelism. It is used for fellowship. It is used for the development of, of young people to be men and women of God. There are so many reasons that life groups are important. So, so how does it work? How do we... How do we look at what a life group is, uh, developing our relationship with God and one another and, and fostering leadership? How does that work? It is simple. And I, I don't think that I can make it more simple. It is living life with each other. It is gathering together with a group of people, 12, 12 strong, in your house, maybe here at the church, maybe you want to go out to eat, and you just invest in each other's lives. There is no age bracket for this. There is not a person who is too young for a life group or discipleship. There's not a person who is too old for discipleship in a life group. This crosses the spectrum of age. It crosses the spectrum of generation. It crosses the spectrum of life experience. And in fact, all of those things benefit the discipleship, the leadership development, the fellowship, the investment in one another, and our investment uh, that, 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 we, that we put into our relationship with God and our, and our growing in our spiritual life. All of those just simply hammer down on what a life group really is. So it, 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 it is simply that. It is coming together once a week, twice a month, what, whatever it may be, to invest in somebody. And the great thing about life group ministry is that as they life groups begin to grow and they begin to develop you will have these relationships that come out and i'm telling you from my own personal experience in life group ministry and discipleship just one time a week or or twice a month simply is not enough to reach out to my brothers and to my sisters who not only encourage me but god has given me the privilege of encouraging them so yeah as as we come to the end of this year you're going to begin to hear more about it at the end of this month we have a life group information meeting. You're able to go down and uh, support uh, support the the, the uh, fundraiser meal that we do on that last Sunday. Grab your meal, come to the fellowship, uh, to come to the youth building, and just have a time where we can just discuss what is a life group. I want to hear your questions. Uh, I believe that they that they are important. Any 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 anything that could pop up in your brain, I want to be able to be there uh, to try to answer for you. So there's a lot of stuff going on. Life groups are extremely important. If you look out in the foyer, you're gonna see uh, some pamphlets 
out there this week that, that you can grab and they have information about life groups as far as biblical examples, what they do, why they're important. The vision for Mount Olive Baptist Church is very simple, uh, trifold pamphlet with, it's not a lot of information, but it gives you a good representation of what life group ministry is and how we want to implement it here at the church. So I'm looking forward to seeing what God is going to do by us simply setting aside some time in our life to live life together. It is important. God has called us to do it. And I'm looking forward to the growth that is going to happen in our church because we are being faithful to investing in one another, to living life together. God is good. See y'all.